Smart driving starts with good decisions, and the Consumer Electronics Association and its member companies are committed to ensuring that consumers are aware of the many ways technology can reduce distraction behind the wheel. I think as we think of automated driving, most of the time the, uh, the mindset moves to something without a driver. And here what we're using is a long range radar that we use for adaptive cruise control or automatic emergency braking. We get to more sophisticated in a dense urban environment with, uh, with all the pedestrians and all of the jaywalkers and all of the cross traffic and everything else. So. The smartphone has become a trusted co-pilot for many drivers. They want the apps and services they use on the phone to be available in the car in a way that makes sense for driving. So with Android Auto, we are trying to uh, move the functions that people want to use when they're driving into the car in a way that's safer for uh, people to use. We know that people text when they drive, even though that's really generally quite a bad idea, and in most cases it's actually illegal. So when Android Auto connects to the car, which I'm going to do here with a USB cable, you're going to see that the phone screen actually gets locked out. So people's not tempted to interact with it when they're driving. We can put that down. And here on the car screen, we have the Android interface that's been redesigned for the car in a way that's supposed to be safe for to use. Automotive electronics manufacturers and automotive makers are working together to seamlessly integrate technology to improve the driving experience. So one of the classic problems of autonomous driving or any new type of technology is we're asking people their thoughts and impressions of a technology they maybe haven't experienced themselves. So Vistian's developed a research methodology that allows us to dig deeper into some of those types of applications so we can understand their experiences even if they haven't uh, directly interacted with the technology. Companies large and small are working to provide drivers with tools to stay alert behind the wheel. The Smart Wheel is the first intelligent steering wheel cover that helps prevent distracted driving. And what it does is it actually keeps track of the driver's hand position. And from that, our device is able to determine when the driver is distracted. When it detects that the driver is distracted, it alerts the driver in real time to refocus them on the road ahead. And it records that event for later review through our companion mobile application, which connects to our device via Bluetooth. Um, and allows parents and employers to be able to track the driver's improvement over time with a simple safety grade and also a breakdown of their driving behavior to identify problem areas. About 30% of U.S. households now own a vehicle with communications, safety, or entertainment systems. But there are solutions available in the aftermarket for those who want to add them to their existing vehicle. So lane departure, it's going to tell you when you've come off lane, it's going to give you an audible indicator. So if you put your head, head down to put on makeup, eat something, text, you're going to get a notification that you're off lane. In addition, what else is going to happen if you approach a vehicle too closely and now same thing, you're not looking, you're about to hit them, you'll get a forward collision warning. So you get lane departure and forward collision warning. Again, not solving the problem, but giving your 18-year-old driver a fighting chance. They got a shot of now some measures that's going to help prevent an accident. Innovation holds the key to automotive safety. I'm Laura Hubbard for CEA's Innovating Safety Campaign.